Just give it a job right now, okay? Come on. Let's give it a job. Let's get ready to go here. Short on time to 10 minutes. Gonna get in some car. It's more running, some jogging, and then a few arm movements. So this next week coming up, we be extremely short on time. So these 10 minutes sets are gonna be happening all week. I'll have my cardio for 10. I'll have the um, straight building for 10. Hold on a second. Let me get this one thing off my screen. Keep going, keep going, keep going. I realize I have it kind of high. We're gonna look at that. Get off my screen. Okay. All right. Don't you hate it when you're doing something and all of a sudden it's pop up on your window screen? Your computer, I didn't tell you to open that. Okay, so, uh, so yes, I will be very short on time this next week. So I will be doing a 10 minutes at a cardio, which will be 10 to 12 minutes, you know how I go. And then I'll be doing the pull ups and the sit ups, for, of course. So the pull ups take approximately five minutes, the sit ups take been taking actually the set of combinations would take about 12 minutes, 10 minute cardio, and about we have spent about roughly 10 minutes on just one focus weight, solid weight for for 10 minutes on um, whatever whichever one it is. I'm gonna do get those in there to get it done, and then probably do like a five minute stretch instead of a 10 minute stretch, which I normally do to try to get in. And see, that's already too much time for me. But so how it's gonna happen. So it's gonna be 10, 20, 30, 40. It's still 45 minutes. So we'll see how we can do this and get it done. How we can manage it. The little running mat thing is, is moving slightly. Let's see if we can move it back. The clothes is like jack, 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 jack. It's supposed to be adding your arms to you, right? Okay, it's gonna drive me crazy. Let me just straighten it up real fast. All right. Okay. Arms out there. All right, so you got your jog, you got your march, you got your run, whatever you're doing. You got your arms out, hold them tight. We're at our two minute mark right now, which I know I have a lot of like changes just come up in and out with his arms. Wake them up. I haven't done my pull ups yet, I'm gonna do them after this. So wake it up the arms. Take them out there, pulse them up. Keep that jaw going. All right, take those arms. Keep them out there. We're not dropping them yet. Twist them forward. You should be getting the burn in the shoulders. You should be feeling them, holding them tight. You can feel the burn in other areas on your arm too. Hold them tight. Tilt my hands slightly up. High angle up there. Keep on jogging. Keep them twisting. Come on. Pause. Reverse. So I'm gonna have to figure out for next week how I can make this work with my schedule. I might not be able to get as much, even as much time as I want to. And I may have to do shorter cardio on the on the weight days, and then more cardio on the non weight days. Palms facing up. Keep them going. Twisting backwards with palms up. Pause. Pulse them up, palms are up. Twisting them back. In, out, in, out, in, out, in, out. Keep going. Out, tap, out, tap, out, tap. Right 
I might have to do, this is what I think I'm gonna end up having to do. So it's gonna be different than what I was thinking at first. See, I'm still trying to figure it out for next week. My brain's still trying to figure it out. I think the core's gonna happen like it's like normal. Drop it down for a second. Shake them up. The core's gonna happen like normal. The pull ups happen like normal. And then I'm gonna add in uh, real quick. Hit it, get the warm up. So we're just gonna do a warm up cardio. Get in there, get the body going for a couple minutes of cardio, right on into weights. Because I really don't have the time. So they're gonna be real quick, get two workouts. They'll be good add on workouts or short on time to get in there, get that body going, get the weights in. And then on Wednesday, when it's not a weight day, we'll just get more cardio. That's gonna be that's gonna be more like what I'm gonna have to do because that'll keep it down closer to 30 minutes. I'll be able to get it done then. Because the more I do, the sooner earlier I have to get up, and I'm looking at having to get up right about two o'clock in the morning next week. So today I was gonna arms out, punch. This is day I was going to work from the house, but because of clients still bringing stuff in for taxes. I have to go to the office. So it's gonna be a midnight run at the office, not the house, which means I have to make myself drive home afterwards. And I'm tired. Yesterday, drop it, come on. Yesterday, or not yesterday, the day before, when I did it, drove home, it's around 10 o'clock. I was falling asleep. So I slapped myself in the face. Boom, 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 boom. Oh my goodness gracious, I bruised my cheek. <laughs> it's like, no, I'm asleep. It was just myself, slapping myself. Uh, but you do what you can to do. It's not a long drive, but it's down, jab it down. It's in an area of, like nothing is for a while. It's all about the county. I say country, but the county more is what it is, but it is out of, out of count, country, it's not part of it. Which is not much around, which is why I don't go outside and jog or run. It's two or three in the morning, not because of um, people, but because of cars. Not cars, sorry, animals. There really isn't any cars out there this morning. But running back down the street with rows of trees on both sides of you, you know, the wolves could come out of them. <laughs> in backfisted. You just gotta do something, get your body going, keep it moving, get your jog in there, whatever. Mowgli is sleeping with his laying down with his head on. He's not sleeping, but he's watching me. But his head is on the little cushion thingy. Isn't that cute? He found himself a little pillow. Crazy cat. He resorts to going like, you're doing it again, lady. He follows me around, cries all morning, wanting attention. And when I come to the mat, he knows the general. He's only go to the mat down. Once I start stop jogging, he's like on it half the time, huh? In my face. Come on. One more time. Hold it out there. Jacks. Change them from side to front side. I'm gonna go a couple side, about a minute over the 10 minute mark because of computer, I think pop pop up on computer. Okay. Uh, 
right, 10 minutes now. Still. Shake them off. Come down. Walk it down. That's enough. Put the heart rate up. Warm up the body. Warm up the arms. Legs out. Up and over. Other side. Step it back. Draw back, hands together, all straight up. Ah, switch your legs, hands back, step it back, pull it up, come on. Hands on knees, twist. Be what I have to do next week too is instead of a separate stretch at the very end, just add the stretch at the end of the workout. Just gotta get it in, gotta find a way to get it done because each one takes time to do too. But I gotta find my way getting in there. Not gonna make, not gonna skip the day just because I'm short on time. I gotta find a way to just get in there, get something done, and move on, knowing that the following week. After Monday, not Monday, but the following week, starting Tuesday, Monday will be an insane day. Starting Tuesday, I can start to get a little bit more sleep. So I have major deadlines, but it's going to get a little more sleep, right? <laughs> this one's checked off, boom, boom, and we're done.